Wow, what an audience. What a great group of people. And welcome to the very first edition of Huckabee in our new home on TBN and from our beautiful new theater just outside of Nashville in Hendersonville, Tennessee. Now tonight, I want to tell you what you can count on from us each week. We're going to feature newsmakers whose decisions affect you and your family. And we're going to try to make sense of some of the issues that you hear about, but which are often confusing because they're all wrapped up in the secret code of Washington's alphabet soup of IRS, DOJ, FBI, NSC, DNI, GSA, CIA, and DOD. It makes you feel like a DOG that's DOA. <laughs> now, look, I'm not a journalist. I don't even play one on TV. I've got strong views, and I'll certainly express them. By the way, most of the people who say they are journalists, they really aren't. They, too, have strong views, but they pretend to be objective. But I want to have some honest discussions of issues that impact you. I don't want people yelling at each other and talking over each other. I am not interested in the horizontal political talk of the left, right, liberal, conservative, Democrat, Republican, where two opposing sides trade very predictable talking points at what's wrong with the other side, but which never gets to a solution. Instead of horizontal politics, we're going to focus on vertical politics, measuring ideas not by whether it's right or left, but whether it takes us up or down. I'm not going to try to raise your blood pressure to 300 over 200 by pushing your emotional buttons. We'll inform you. We're going to encourage you. We'll even entertain you. And there's going to be much more than politics and newsmakers on the show. We're going to bring you features about some great American treasures that we call Huck's Heroes, and also some of the towns in our heartland that you've never heard of, but which are a part of the fabric of our country. And we will entertain you with a variety of music and comedy and special features just to remind us all that there really is more to life than bad news. And of course, since we do the show in Music City, USA, you can bet your banjo, bass drum, and baritone voice that we're going to have music, lots of it. And our very own band, Trey Corley and the Music City Connection, they're going to rock the house for our studio audience as well. For our viewers at home. Yeah. I'm even going to join the band from time to time for my amusement mm -hmm. and your amazement. <laughs> now, am I good enough to play with these guys and some of our guest artists? Heck no. But hey, it's my show, so of course I get to join them. Well, joining us as our announcer is Keith Bilbrey, the longtime announcer at the Grand Ole Opry and disc jockey at WSM, the flagship radio station for the Opry. Keith, I cannot tell you how excited I am that you're part of our team. I'm excited to be here. On behalf of Nashville and Music City, we welcome you. You can play your bass anytime you want to, as long as I get to play pedal steel with you. How, it sounds that? like a deal, Keith. You play I better bass in. than I do pedal steel, by the way. <laughs> and by the way, if you're going to be in the Nashville area, we hope that you'll be part of the Huckabee experience in our studio. Now, the tickets are free, but you need to reserve them. And you can do that at HuckabeeOnTBN.TV. That's HuckabeeOnTBN.TV. For my first show, I wanted to book both the biggest name in politics and also wanted to get the most talked about person in Hollywood. And we got him because he's the same person. You see, no one makes more news and gets talked about more on the news than our first guest, who is also our president, Donald Trump. Wow. Now, whether you love him or don't, you can't ignore him. And we were honored to be invited to the White House for the first sit-down exclusive interview with President Trump since he visited Puerto Rico and Las Vegas this week. We sat down with the President in the Roosevelt Room at the White House. <laughs> 